Hi, my name is Kwame, and my project is WizAI. It's an autonomous AI agent for Web3 developers. This is going to ask us what type of website that we are going to build today. We're going to do something pretty easy. We're just going to say, need a website that returns the current Ethereum block. Now we have our project manager, which sets up the goal. We have a solutions architect that comes in with the scope of the actual project. Our solutions architect will actually go out and um, create a testing endpoint that we can use to test our application. Now we'll send off this to another agent, which is named the backend developer. This will go out and actually start writing the code for us. If it comes up with any errors or uh, bugs or areas of improvement, the agent will go and actually perform those particular tasks. Now this does take a bit of time. That's why we're doing something very, very simple because as the complexity gets larger, uh, the time to do this is, is longer as well. So. It's telling us that this is totally written by AI and now we need to go and review this code. So we're gonna go through and review it. I'm going to scroll up here. There is um, blocks in the code so that we do actually have to manually go in here and uh, remove them so that it doesn't actually automatically just go and deploy this code. Okay, so I'm looking at this. We can see here that we have our endpoint for the current block, and it's using this block cipher to um, get the, the latest block. Okay, so I'm gonna say that this is all good. Now the backend developer is going to do some unit testing on the code. It's going to um, print out the rest endpoints and it's actually going to do a test on a serve, backend server behind the scenes. So what this has done is has updated the main RS file and actually given us a API uh, schema as well. So we're going to, um, I'm just going to list this out. I'm gonna go into the server template I'm gonna run cargo run. And now we have our API running. So I'm going to type in localhost 8080 and then our, uh, we'll get the current block. Block. And here we go. So that's an example of our tool called WizAI. It's pretty much a SaaS project that allows backend developers that are designing Web3 applications to quickly spin up uh, backend uh, servers um, and API endpoints. And um, yeah, thanks for another great hackathon, ETH Global, and hope to see you in the finals.